sunrise at Fontana Lake. Okay, guys, it is Sunday, February 23rd, day 14. We are at the Fontana Lodge. We are going through our resupplies. Got Caruso and Night Train. Night Train's got his ginormous resupply over here. And here's mine. Thank you, Mom. Holy goodness, that looks awesome. Mom, can I get a resupply like that too? <laughs> nope, these are only for me. <laughs> All right. About to go head up and go eat some breakfast. Just showing y'all this awesome bracelet that Caruso's wife, Penny, made for us. Penny, thank you so much. This is so cool. Hey guys, so we've made it to the Fontana Village and sitting out here on the balcony from the room. Kind of get a look around here. Pretty nice place. Really nice room for hikers. Nicer than we're used to. But I can't really take you in there right now because it is, we have destroyed it with pack explosion everywhere. So anyway, we're gonna run down here and do our laundry. And then uh, I think we're gonna spend most of the day just up off our feet, kind of heal up a little bit and um, get ready for tomorrow. Tomorrow's a long day. I think we're doing 18 out of here. And, uh, but it's gonna be a beautiful hike other than I think they're calling for some weather to start moving in for the next several days may see a little snow once we get up high we'll see all right well that's going to just about do it for now um probably take you guys to dinner tonight and uh let you see what what the dining hall and all that looked like all right see you then y'all it is the end of day 14 which we have zeroed here in Fontana at the village give you guys a quick spin around here so you can see the nice green swimming pool <laughs> anyhow um, today we've spent most of the day just kind of hanging out and um, we did our laundry and we ate breakfast and then we just now got back from dinner. They have a little restaurant here, it's pretty good. Um, anyhow, so it looks like in the morning, the earliest we're gonna be able to get out of here is around 8.30. Unfortunately, that's when the shuttle starts. So tomorrow's gonna be a long day. I don't expect to get to camp before dark because I think tomorrow is something like 17 miles and they're fairly tough miles getting up into the park, so. Oh, we did get our permits today too also, so that's good. Um, I did want to answer a question I got from my buddy PJ in the last video. Um, he asked me what it was like to basically start all over again and, and try to redo the trail. And um, so far, it's been great. Um, I've seen a lot of things this go around that I missed the last time. Um, you know, I was telling the early riser in a comment that, um, you know, when we came over Chio Bald in 2018, um, we came over, you know, we got up early that morning and went over Chio Bald in the dark and it was a, you know, cloudy, rainy morning. I didn't even know that view was there. So imagine my surprise when I pop up there this year and it is just, you know, amazing. So, <laughs> Yeah, and, and there's been several other little views that I missed. So yeah, I mean, it's there's still a lot to see. There's still a lot new out here that I haven't seen. So it, that's been great. Um, he also asked me um, if I'm scared of getting hurt again. And yes and no. I mean, you, I'm paying a lot of attention this time around. I'm making sure that that I am paying attention to every little thing, you know, if something starts bothering me, like I had a, a little knot in my calf and 
you know, I kept rolling it every night and every night. And, and I finally rolled that little knot out and my calf's feeling better. So, hey, that's great. You know, a couple blisters here and there, but but yeah, I'm a, I'm a little more aware of every little injury that I'm getting and paying a lot of attention to it because I don't want a little injury to turn into a big one. Um, but other than that, it, you know, th this, this second go around is, is just, um, a real blessing and I'm very thankful for it. So, uh, yeah, PJ, this is great. I mean, you don't get second time around very often and, uh, you know, I'm fortunate enough to get that. So believe me, I feel lucky. Also guys, I just want to say thanks. I want to say thanks for, for the support, um, for all the great comments, man. You guys make my day all the time. You just can't even imagine how much I appreciate you. So um, I'm gonna get back out there in the morning and uh, get some more videos up as soon as possible. I'm not sure if I'll be able to get anything up while I'm in the Smokies or not. Um, we're looking at probably a four day trip through there. Um, if I get cell signal, I'll try to get them up from trail. If not, it'll be just as soon as possible. So, um, you know, four, five, six days, it could be that long before you see any, anything else from me. Um, but just know I'll be out there chugging away and uh, I'll, I'll uh, get them up as soon as possible. And um, until then, thank you and I'll talk to you soon.